the Hello? Accumulation, but I know we didn't get too much. Hello? So, Hello, Mrs. Iannotti? Yeah. Hi, Mrs. Iannotti. My name is Trish. I'm calling from the Chimney Company. How are you? Are you Santa Claus calling? I'm calling for the chimney that Santa Claus comes down, yes. Oh, God. What do you want with my chimney? We want to clean it for you. We're running a great special right now. Half price cleaning. Well, explain it to me. What was that? Explain it to me loud. Cause okay. I will scream loud for you. Do you hear this gas or oil? Well, what do you think? I hate the whales. No. No, gas or oil? Which one do you heat with? I use the whales. The whale, the whale oil. Okay, so with the oil, you we're clean, the pipe from your furnace, that exhaust fumes go out. We're cleaning yeah. that place with a 21-point inspection and a draft test. We want to service your home for you. Can we service your home for you while we're out there? Save you some money? Does the Mary Poppins lover with the chimney sweep come here with the umbrella and flying around it? If you want, I'll come here with an umbrella and fly around. Where are you? Are you in the third world countries or are you in Rhode Island? I'm in Rhode Island. I'm what? right in one socket. Oh, how is the weather up there? Oh, it's beautiful. Nice and icy. Well, I have to tell you, I live in a home and we share the, the, the chimney there with the crematory. Okay, but well we can still come down there and clean your gas, I mean your oil food pipe before you see that. It's half price, we're going to save you some money. It's 79 not 160 like everybody else charges. Do you charge more because it's a crematory and human remains get burnt and incinerated up the chimney? Uh, we, don't, we don't charge more for that. So what, it's seventy nine ninety five. Well, that's good. Do you want to have us come out there and clean it for you? What do you use to clean the bones off the walls? Um, I'm not sure. I'm not the one who actually cleans your chimney. Do you get all the bones and the finger bones off there? What day do you want us to come clean your chimney for well, you? Well, you gotta tell me because the teeth get brought up and the teeth get caught all in the cracks of the chimney. And they need to make sure that all the teeth and the gold fillings in the teeth get pulled out of the cracks with the bones. Okay, Mr. Because it's a crematory where they burn people. That's not a problem. What day do you want us to come out there? Do they know that I burn people here? That's okay. What day do you want us to come out there? What happens if I burn one of their relatives? Are they going to be hurt? Because the teeth and the bones. That's okay. What and the bones and the teeth, too. When? The teeth. Saturday. There's the bones, though. They don't know what they're doing with the bones and the teeth. I need to have them. So when they clean them, I need them to put them in a sandwich bag. And then I need them to deliver the, the sandwich bag to me. Hold on one second, Mrs. Iannotti. Hold on one second. You sound like you're a rapper or something. No, I got a little cold, Mrs. Iannotti. You sound, now you're yelling at me. Why are you yelling? I'm not yelling at you, I'm sick. You're using a nasty tone with me. No, Mrs. Iannotti, not at all. I'm just very sick right now. Does the sickness affect your brain and make you angry at me? I'm not angry at you, Mrs. Iannotti. You sound like you're yelling at me. And now you're scaring me. I'm sorry, Miss Iannotti. What was that? You're scaring me. This is Iannotti. Do you want to have your chimney cleaned? I have a retort with the crematory with the bones in the teeth. I told you. I know this, but... You and you're yelling at me, and you say you're sick. I'm sorry you're sick. You should go to the walk-in clinic where they take you people like you. 
Oh, where they take people like me? Where is it? In Woonsocket, where you're calling from. Isn't that where you said? Yes, I'm in Woonsocket, Mrs. Iannotti. Well, go go get yourself fixed. I can't, though. I'm at work. Oh, Lord. I'll just pray for you. Thank you. Thank you, Mrs. Iannotti. I appreciate it. I'll pray. Our Father, who art living in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Kingdom come for you in moon socket with the sore throat and the anger towards me. Are you saying something to someone else that I'm praying for you? Yeah, you know, I may be old, but I'm not deaf. Now I'm going to pray for the devil to take you. <laughs> <laughs> that stupid bitch. <laughs>